Please, have a seat. There seems to be an issue at hand. What issue might that be? I would like to be direct, if I may. Please? I would like for you to tell me, what is your relation with Sir Talbot? Whatever do you mean? Don't fool with me, girl. You know exactly what I mean. We are friends. Good friends, indeed. Good friends, indeed. Will that be all? I have sent for him. I will have you know that your relation shall come to its end today. What are you doing? You will have nothing more to do with that man. He is not fit to be in the presence of your company. I know his family well enough to know that any communication between you and him shall certainly deliver you to harm. How dare you? Don't. You will abide by my rules. This is not up for discussion. Now, when Sir Talbot arrives, he will be treated and greeted most fair. However, as soon as he leaves his premises, he will never look back upon the likes of you again. My father would never... I know what is best for you. This is final. It is my honour and my duty to care for your well-being at all times. Now, this friendship that you claim shall go no further, simply because of whom this man is spawned from. Whom is he derived from? He's not like his family. He has nothing to do with them. He's a good man, living an honest life. His reputation is remarkable. Ask anybody in town. I said that is enough. My word is final, Sandra. The apple does not fall far from the tree. There is no doubt in my mind this man will not fall far from where his father lies this present day. You're wrong about this, Uncle. That I may be. However, why take a chance? I will not play chess with your soul. Why do you have to be so hard? Have you no kindness? I can assure you, my dear, this is my greatest act of kindness. I don't expect for you to understand. May I leave now? That you may. <laughs>